Yo, what is going on, you guys? This is Mike or Geekermon, and welcome back, welcome back. We finished it. The round of 64 is behind us. Now, we are moving on to the round of 32. If you guys have been following along, we're in the middle of Destiny 2 March Madness in July. It's been a blast of a series where all these legendaries and exotics have been randomized and have been going head to head to see who will be the ultimate champion of Destiny 2. Does it mean it's the best weapon? No. Does the best weapon always win March Madness? No. The point is that there's chaos. There's up sets. There's blowouts. We had the Skyburner's Oath drop 42 points, tying for the highest of all time in the bracket so far. It's been so much fun. I've had just an absolute blast with it so far. So I will say, today's episode, Aaron Till versus Arbalest. Two unruly weapons. These guys are both so strong. The first weapon to go is going to be Aaron Till. That thing is just an absolute beast. A lot of people hate it, and for good reason. You can get mapped with that guy. The other weapon, Arbalest, I feel like is actually one of the most powerful powerful weapons in the game. The way that the Arbalest plays, it just, it's such a clean gun. There, I mean, there, you can rack up so many kills with the Arbalest, and I feel like the ammo economy doesn't feel that punishing with this weapon. You can only use the Arbalest and put up 40 easily. Exciting round. Don't forget, you can follow along with the bracket. First link in the description. I update it every time I post a new video. I update the winner in the bracket. And when we get to the Sweet 16, I'm going to post a, a graphic over on Twitter and have you guys fill out the Sweet 16 bracket. I think it's going to be super, super fun. So without further ado, Let's jump right into Arbalest v. Arantel. If you're new, take a second. Subscribe down below. It means the world to me, helps the channel grow, and let's roll into the gameplay. Oh, baby. Time to snipe some people with the Arantel. Now, a couple of rolls that I have, and you guys have to tell me which one you think is better. I've got a long range roll with firmly planted and rangefinder, and it's got a counterbalance stock on it. Then I have a max impact with a longer charge time that's got hip fire grip and rampage. And I threw, <laughs> went ahead and threw a rampage spec on there. I figured why not. I think personally that I like this uh, firmly planted rangefinder with the sniper scope better. I feel like it's more more consistent at long range. Like it's got this cool scope on it. It absolutely just maps people. I think that's what I like about it is I'm not leaving people at a sliver of health. That happens a little too much with the rampage build for sure. Yep, that right there. Yeah, what are you gonna? Oh, you're gonna use a primary against that? I'm quitting. That's it. That we're done. <laughs> Some, I played somebody the other day and I got a message that said, Geek, YouTuber, I can't believe you're rage quitting on me. And I literally was, I had to leave. Haley was like, hey, it's time to go. I'm like, oh, well, I guess I'm gonna head out. This dude thought that I had rage quit the game and he bothered messaging me on Xbox. I was like, okay, okay. All right, so we got Mari on the other team. I'm seeing some uh, capable gameplay there in the background. That looked like somebody who knows what they're doing. Will that be enough to stop the power of the air until? No, it will not. Nothing is. Literally, what are you gonna do? I mean, what? I guess the only solution is just not to have ammo, right? How did my grenade not kill you? You were standing in the flame of the grenade. Oh, sir. There we go, got him, got more ammo, perfect. This dude's pushing, wait, two guys pushing. Ooh, got him, stay back, stay back. I got one shot left, one opportunity. Wait, what in the, whoa! No, 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 sir. Did you try to snipe me? You're crazy, man. Where are they at? Okay, one guy's outside. Look at this dude. I think that was the unbroken guy from earlier, right? <laughs> yeah, more over to the right. I'm gonna try it, a sniper. I crouched to get that extra range on him too. Watch this. Oh, imagine. Oh, imagine, that was so close. Just tether right there. Not gonna hit anyone. Teammate died around a corner. There we go. I'm just gonna flank this way. I mean, I guess I'm not gonna be able to do any, uh... Line up, <laughs> line up faster, fellas. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Which side? I don't know which side they're on. There's one. Second dude's further back. I'm sure I'm gonna get some nice, lovely Xbox messages from this other team. I know I am. I feel kind of bad for you. It's part of the bracket, okay? I didn't want to use just the air until, but it's where we are right now. Finish them! I will. Oh my goodness, get him out of here. Behind the tunnel, gotcha. I'm scaring them! They'll never want to match with me again! I've played too much Destiny 2 PvP, dude. Like, honestly, i played way too much. It's getting to the point where I know the dialogue lines before they even happen. Jump up here. Oh, he's absolute. Turn up! Let's go, baby! Geek! It's the air until chill. Yo, this is a good match. I don't care what weapon I'm using. I'm allowed to be excited about it, okay? <laughs> Golly. 
<laughs> I mean, good grief. All right, come on. Oh, no. Oh, man. Yeah, you, I guess you can have that ammo. I mean, I did all the work, but whatever. You take it. All right, I'll get on zone B. Push down this hallway. There we go. A little more green right here. Very nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Wait, behind me. Got him? I didn't even see that guy until it was almost too late. There we go. Got him. This gun's crazy, dude. Will Aaron Till just win the whole tournament? I don't know. Maybe so. Wouldn't surprise me at this point. Okay. Very nice. Very nice indeed. 150 to 50 against an unbroken as well. A couple of solid players on the other team. 27 opponents defeated. All right. I will pause, check the scoreboard real quick, and then we will jump right back into it. All right. First match behind us. We went 23 and 7. Not a bad game. Let's see what the final score was, though. We had 21 kills at the Aaron Till, 4 assists, and we were first place on the winning team that puts us at 2 to 25 points 25 I'm gonna go ahead and add that to the bracket because I guarantee you guys are gonna ask me about the scores I'm trying to keep up with them okay all right Arbalest 25 is the match to beat now Arbalest put up like 33 or 34 first uh first round so we'll see how it does now but I'm pretty optimistic because this gun is just an absolute legend you you know how good this gun is there's no point even trying to argue it that was a body shot Oh no, that was too. Now, a lot of people ask me why I dodge so much. I run a hundred and a hundred and something mobility. It's a little bit overkill, but it gives me that eight second dodge cooldown, which is absolutely clutch for trying to slay out with a specific weapon. You didn't have green ammo, huh? Yeah, the eight second dodge is kind of underrated, especially for, uh, oh, oh, hold on. There we go. The eight second dodge is like a, you have to have it in order to use certain weapons effectively. You could try, but manually reloading a lot of guns gives you a, uh... All right, sir, where you at? Where you at? I see that little, uh, you're dropping that little wombo on us. Oh my goodness. Flinch who? Who? Right here? Is he going right? Yep. Oh no. I hope he's not streaming. I feel bad. All right, let's see what these guys are doing out here, shall we? Are you AFK? What are you... There's always one. There's always one AFK guy ruining my YouTube videos. Like, we're just gonna start a trend where it's like, why is there someone AFK in every single every single lobby? Seriously. Go. Let's see. Oh, yep. Oh, that guy's absolute. Oh, they're both absolute. Push me. Shouldn't have pushed me. That was a bad decision on your part. I got more ammo. Yep. There we go. This gun. This gun is seriously, it is a beast of a weapon. It is so strong. I don't know if there's any guns that compete with the Arbalest at every range. There's the AFK guy again. Still hadn't been kicked. I'm telling you, I'm going to put a petition to Bungie for the amount of time you're allowed to stand in a quick play match without moving before they kick you. Because it is way too long. All right. 47 to 20. I don't think this is going to be a mercy rule. Thankfully. Thankfully, it's not going to be a mercy rule. That... I'm sorry, Cosmic. Around a corner, I just killed that guy. You know, I really never thought Destiny 2 quick play matches were that fast until I started doing these challenges. And now I feel like all the time I'm like, oh, if the game had been like one or two minutes longer, it would have been so clutch. Could have been more right there, but I didn't get credit for that one. Ow! What is wrong with you? Yikes. Come on, come on, push me. You got a whole team, push me. Got him, more ammo real quick. Bada bing, bada boom. Oh, okay, let's not do that. Actually, I gotta snipe him. I have to. I body shot him. Oh, he's still near us. Watch out, teammate. Yeah, we missed that first snipe, but we made up for it. Don't you worry. <laughs> Poor guy. I'm sorry, Cosmic. I gotta step my game up here. I feel like we're doing well, but we should be doing great with the Arbalest, you know? What kind of what kind of YouTube video is well gameplay? No. That's actually a little shade thrown at the Well of Radiance right there. Nice little double on him, and I tried to go out for the ammo, but Merc is out there with the mountaintop. Come on. Oh, I got one shot. Why is the why am I not picking up the ammo? Come on now. That could have been a lights out or more. Easily could have been. Ooh, missed that guy. Got that guy though. Grab this real quick. Sir, face up. There we go. Very nice. Alright, what do we do? What do we do? Do I just send it to him? What do you do when your mountaintop's out of ammo? I don't know! Got him! Oh good, Mike. 
And a melee kill. That could have been two kills right there. And I folded like a rusty old lawn chair. All right. If we lose by two, I'm going to be upset. Because <laughs> we got a melee kill. Should have been a headshot. And I, miss, I missed an easy first snipe on him. All right. So let me double check the score. Was it 25 was the score? 36 with the Arbalest, though. We will see what happens. I'll pause, check the score, and then come back. All right. 26 kills and seven assists puts us at 29.5. Plus first place on the losing team is two bonus points. So we are at 31 points. Five. The Arbalest takes out the Arantil, and we'll be moving on to the next round. Man, we had 21 headshots. Whoever tells you the Arbalest is not a good weapon anymore, use it. I promise you, you will enjoy it. Pair it with a sidearm. It's really, really strong with a sidearm or a good SMG up close. You guys are going to have a good time with this weapon. So, all right, guys, that's going to do it for me. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Don't forget, leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Hit the bell if you haven't. We're moving on to the next game of round of 32. Up next, tomorrow's episode is going to be Jade Rabbit versus Polaris Lance, Scout Rifle v. Scout Rifle. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.